Hello, welcome back to the channel. We've uh, decided because it's a really hot day, we've come out to a place called Brockhill Country Park. Never been here before, but we're going to have a little look. So there is uh, Brockhill Country Park. We paid and we displayed. Obviously, Lula's at school. We've got Eden and Indy. So we're going to go for a walk around and have a little look what's going on. See if there's any fun to be had. So where are we? We're here somewhere, we're we? Main entrance. Oh, there's a lake as well. No, visitor centre, so we're here. So there's a play area down there somewhere. Yeah. yeah. And I've just noticed that they do bushcraft here. So they do campfire lighting and cooking. £25 for adults and 15 quid for kids. So I think it might be worth something for Lula, really, because she likes the outdoors and stuff. We'll have to have a see. Yeah, it's quite nice. Really nice place. Lots of trees, nice and cool. Here she comes. Here she comes. There's some cow. There's an old cow there. Ah, hey, you thought I was pointing the camera at you, didn't you? No. Guess what they do here? Food and drink. Clotted cream teas. Three pounds sixty. Kirst is very weak at the knees for a cream tea. <laughs> Have you paid and displayed? Look, look, Daddy, look. Can you see the birds? Can you see the birdies? Papa. You like birds? Papa. You love birds? It's a nice little bit for a mountain bike to go on. I used to do that when I was younger. I, would, I wouldn't even hesitate. I'd get straight on there if when I was 14. Not now. That slide the other day down at Wildwood was enough for me. There's a tunnel you can go in, girl. to the slide. Birds of the round table, huh? Birds of the round table. Right, you're going to sit at the table nicely, have some food, and then you can have a run around. Hey! Hey! Is that good? Look at that smile. Hey! <laughs> Hold on to there. Hey, hey, hey. Indy. 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 <laughs> Up the hill. Up the steps. Go on then, up we go. Good girl. Come on, I'm coming. Quick, quick, quick. <coughs> yeah. Oh, lots of steps, isn't there? Big steps. One. You can do it. Three. One. Four. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Whoa! I've got you. Come on. Whoopsie. Up you get, silly. Come on, then. One more. Oh, look at that pretty flower you found. I will pick. You're going to pick it? Yeah. You're going to keep it? Pick it then. Yeah, you got them. Ready? Yeah. It's a long way down. 
Let go of the bar. It's a long way down. Are you ready? <laughs> go again. Right, should we um, get in a push chair and go for a wander around? See what else is there. <laughs> Imagine it's really, really nice and hot in the summer down there. Imagine it gets quite busy. There's a lake here as well, isn't there? Can you get in it? I've got bugs on the lens. Oh wow, this is nice. Quick. See, it's not been much of a rainy, rainy bit at the moment. Oh, yeah, that's nice. It's such a shame you can only take six pictures while you're videoing. <clears throat> All the different flowers that can be found. This is nice. Wow, all those fish. There's loads of fish in there. Oh, yeah. Wow. <laughs> Wonder if they got a fish highway here like Singleton has. <laughs> I imagine they could do some great things. Yeah, they probably could. Really? Ducks, right? They're baby ducks. <gasps> Mummy duck and baby ducks. And a fish just popped up. Oh, look at them. Aren't they cute?
What are we reading? Ah, uh, right, okay. There's a contraption that's in the water on sunny days, but you can't see it at the moment because it's obviously over here somewhere. But it's an aer aerator. Because obviously, uh, when we was over there, I said it was stagnant, didn't I? So they've had a problem with the lake. So many leaves fall in and decompose underwater. There's no movement in the water, so it becomes stagnant. You can smell it. So they put an aerator in there. Solar powered aerator, so it goes underneath the water, up and down, and it mixes it up. It creates bubbles to oxygenate it. Quite a good idea, really. <coughs> it's better than single lake. Oh, yeah, of course. <laughs> Well, I, thought single, I think single length is really pretty. I do, but it's a lot smaller. Is it pretty, girls? Yeah, that keeps the water aerated. You see? You see all the water? Where are we going? Oh! I'm going to have a quick Anders. I'll swap over in a minute. I don't think they go any further because we've got the buggy. Oh, God, blimey. Did you read that board down at the bottom of that waterfall? No. This is a Victorian creation. Oh, the Joneses? Yeah. Yeah, I've got a... Yeah. Um, the King of Spain, back in the early Victorian times, was um, prolific at designing waterfall features. And Mr. Tornay, I think his name was, Tornay Jones, who owned this park in the manor house, was good friends with the Spanish King, and the Spanish King came here and designed all this. That impressive. <laughs> That's the other part of the tree. We cut that on purpose. It's three bunks out on there. Really? 
Yeah, no, back in the early days when it was first made. I thought it was made as a boating lake, a pleasure lake. Because I find most lakes used to be quarries. Huh? I find most lakes like this used to be quarries. Yeah. So this is actually dug for a lake. It's actually dug for a lake, yeah. They put all the trees back and loads. The employer, it's said on one of the boards, the employer, some of the squaddies from Shawncliffe Barracks, we paid them with rum and whiskey and a day's wage to come here and dig. And they've done it over a month. That's a nice bench. That's a good way to get wood. So Morgan's. You feel very small here, don't you? Oh, yeah. And itchy, very, very itchy. Another bridge. That's clear. Wow. That is really clear. Mm -hmm. The little waterfall you can't see. Yeah, Alright girls. This place is massive. Interesting to find out how cold that is. Oh. Oh, that's really warm. Really warm, Surprising seeing this is it's sort of sheltered by trees and stuff, it's quite chilly. Really? Hush! Smells like spring onions, do you think they grow stuff? No, that's wild garlic. Is it? Yeah, that's wild garlic. <coughs> oh, there it is. <laughs> What's up the other end, up the top of that? Not that I'm going to climb up there. Well, you can climb up if you like. No, if, you're feeling, if you're feeling adventurous, feel free. You can tell us all what's yeah, up there. To come up here next time and see what <laughs> I think Take halfway around this place, you'd be giving up the ghost as well. Take the camera with us. <laughs> so many buttercups. 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 Sounds the plan, Stan. Anyone who says we haven't had our exercise today. <laughs> Are you taking the piss or something? Why? You're filming me pushing a push up a really steep hill. Do you get your kicks out of it or something? Yeah, definitely. Yeah. So we stopped to have a break and a drink. Now we have to continue. We're just about to stop at the cafe to have a quite a green tea. Alex wishes. We haven't got time. <laughs> I know. Right, let's swap for a minute. <laughs> You're funny, you, aren't you? Oh, okay. Look, that tree's got an eye, even. Looking at you. That tree's looking at you. Put your back into it. What was that noise? Drumming. It's a school over there, isn't it? <laughs> Sounds like shooting. Oh, it's a bum. That's a uh, Brock Hill school, isn't it? I've just noticed, actually, a few of them have got it. These, you can have um, disposable barbecues here. Can you? Yeah. Some of these tables have got metal frames on. So have barbecue on. There's one there. Mummy! Yeah? Oh, Is it a leaf? Yeah. Come on then, let's keep walking. Get your little legs some exercise. That was Daddy going. He's going to investigate the tables. He gets really excited about disposable barbecues. Sorry? Oh no, I thought you want me to pick you up? No. 
I can't take that because I've got you and the camera. And my hands are full. If you don't want it, you can put it down. Oh, okay. Say bye, Leaf. Bye. 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 Say thank you for keeping me company, Leaf. No. Hand, please, young lady. That's the rules of you being. There you go. It's the rules of you being out your. Bye bye, Leaf. Bye bye. Look, do you want to go in the tree teepee? Should we go in the tree teepee? Ooh. You're going to sit on the, sit on the log. <laughs> Is that fun? Is it nice in here? No, that's just a little person up on the hill with their daddy. Oh, it's so warm today. Wow, that was fun, wasn't it, Dougie? <laughs> We're on our way home. Well, we are actually home now, to be fair. We're only about five minutes away. Um, that was good, actually. Quite enjoyed it. it was nice there. Definitely, we'll go, definitely back. go back to Brockhill Park. And another thing I noticed: those picnic benches as you get into the main bit of the grassy area, and a lot of the picnic benches have got metal stapled to them. So that means that you can take a disposable barbecue. So you might have to barbecue burn up. Um, they also do a craft activity thing, which I spotted for Lula's old sort of age, and she's into artsy fartsy crafty crap. So we might, I might take her up Forest there. school, that's Forest what school. she's doing, isn't it? Yeah, I might take her up there one afternoon. It's six quid for three hours, which is pretty good. Two pound an hour you're paying, you, you know, you get food, and you get to make stuff out of wood. So it was quite nice, nice little trip out. So the art is saying the girls have exhausted, they're still awake, but they're watching their DVD in the back of the car. Um, so yeah, it's a nice little trip out. I thoroughly enjoyed it. Nice to get home though, my feet are like bricks at the moment. Kirsty's ready to flake. <laughs> and Lula's home at four because she's got a art class. Art class! So anyway, thank you very much for watching, if you made it this far. If you did make it this far, type in the comments, bananas, and we'll catch you on the next video. For now, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Bye-bye.